So the Max has three sets of microphones. You've got on the front, the back, and the side. And if you hop into the menu, you can choose which ones you want to use depending on what you're filming. Currently, I'm in the single camera lens hero mode, and I'm using the microphones in the back because I'm using the handy vlog-friendly touchscreen. If you hop into the menus, you can decide in this mode whether you want to use the mics on the back, on the front, or both in stereo. So I'll switch over to the mics on the front now, and you'll be able to hear what's in front of me. Perhaps not ideal audio for vlogging, but you can take in even more of the London city sounds if that's what you're into. The third option in this mode is stereo. As you may imagine, when you're in stereo mode, it's using both the front and the rear mic, so you're getting a blend of everything, all the surroundings. You can choose to manually set the front or rear microphone, depending on what you're filming, or you can leave it in auto mode, and then it just selects the microphone based on which um, lens you're using. In 360 mode, the audio options pick up where they left off, in hero mode. So you have access to stereo audio recording, or what GoPro is calling 360 audio, and this records both stereo and the 360 audio. So it allows you to take in all of your surroundings of your 360 videos. Plenty of street sounds for you here to use as an example for what you can pick up in a 360 recording. Okay, so we are back in the office now. You can hear my voice in isolation without the busy London street sounds. And what I'm going to do is flick between the GoPro Max using the microphones closest to myself and a Rode VideoMic Pro. Uh, Rode VideoMic Pro is uh, you know, a popular run and gun video mic, especially for vlogging. Connects straight to the hot shoe of a DSLR. And I think it should provide a decent reference point so we can see how the uh, GoPro stacks up. They're both uh, roughly the same distance away from me on the table. And you know, we've heard one, we've heard the other. Uh, should give you a nice idea of what the GoPro Max can do. Another audio setting that you'll find in the GoPro Max is the wind reduction. The wind reduction uses all the mics on the Max in order to reduce the sound of wind or water that may be in your shot. I've got wind reduction set on now. See if it's making any difference to this street level noise as the wind is channeled <laughs> between these buildings. You can opt to leave wind reduction on, you can turn it off, or you can set it to auto and let the camera decide whether it's required. And this is wind reduction turned on while in 360 mode recording 360 audio. We can have a bit more wind. Wind is rather inconsistent. <laughs> 